Hi guys, it's me Sai back with another video. So today I'm working on my van. It's hot, sweaty, or whatever. Last time you guys see me, I was doing insulation, but that's all done. Everything's in the car. Like let me show you guys. Like everything's in the car. So right now I'm about to take off the roof rack. So stay tuned. <laughs> So that took me 30 minutes or so. Wasn't too bad because I took out the first bolt, I think, before winter came. So I figure I know how to do it now. So that was pretty easy. Let me show you guys how it's looking now. Can we thank um, iPhone, first of all, for their amazing widescreen? So this is what I'm working with right now. Um, I'm trying to take these rails out, but I can't find the Allen keys for them. Um, this one's coming off, but there's a bracket underneath inside the car that is not coming off so i gotta take that off and uh um i'm pretty much wanting to take off the rails today i'm gonna sand down these rust spots today as well i don't know it looks like it's gonna rain so it might not happen but after i do these my next project is to actually coat the roof with some primer at least so it doesn't further rust and then uh, we're still debating if we want to put the skylight in here or not. I bought it already. I would like to put it in there. But my brother's telling me that we won't have no room for the solar panel. So I don't know what to do. I should have never bought that thing. That thing cost me like nearly $800. So um, yeah. So I guess you guys are going to watch me uh, take these rails out. All right, you guys, I got the first one out. Yay. All right, guys, so I am about to take off the other rail. Lucky for me, they use good bolts on the rails, at least. Like, these bolts they use snap right off. They were cheap, some type of cheap. I don't know what kind of material this is or something. But they use stainless steel on these rails, except for the ends. So the end is, the end of this bolt is kind of spinning the element, so I have to go inside and hold it. But the rest of this is already unbolted. That's a good thing. I'm going to grab all my tools and um, go inside and bend this at the same time. Inside, they have these little bracket things. Um, but yeah, this is what's spinning when I twist it from the top. So I actually have to climb up and hold this on one end and then twist the top up. It's kind of hard. It's I need two... Like I need an extra arm, but when you're working on your, with your, you're working by yourself, you need to figure it out. Okay, this is really ratchet. I'm on this horrible old fashioned ladder that I'm probably gonna end up killing myself doing this when we have better ladders somewhere around here. But I don't have my camera equipment right now. You guys, I'm in the middle of a move. I have all my camera equipment tucked in storage right now so and I don't feel like bringing it out so this will do I bought this iPhone because it has the cinematic feature on it so I was like um and it has a widescreen so I was like I'm gonna well start using the iPhone that cost $1,500 to film YouTube videos right you guys see how close up, how like rusty the top is? I have to sand that all down and then probably like coat it with some type of like um, rust pre prevention. What do they call it? Rust protection spray or coating that helps rust not spread. Because when red start, when rust starts forming on a car, it eats away. It like spreads really fast, like cancer. So I know there's a chemical out there that you can spray on cars that stop, prevents it from doing that. So, here we go. And, whoo, Jesus. Girl, I'm out of shape. How can I be out of shape? I work out every day. I think, like, I need to work on my endurance, my cardio. All right, so I'm going to pry this open. Let me show you guys. 
Just like that. So everything on the roof rack is off. I'm going to end this video here. Um, you guys, thanks for watching the video. And until the next uh, episode or whatever I want to call this. Anyways, I'm so happy. It's finally nice here in Wisconsin. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.